Okay, listen, listen, boys and girls, and all those who are interested in a very unusual way of learning English. So you can learn English with Paul, that's me, and at the same time you can learn some tennis. Now I will show you some coordination exercises, and if you want to have a lesson with me, so it will be done in English or in German or in Czech. I mean, it's um, more interesting for you if you are studying English, so uh, have a look. Yeah? So, so, like this, no? tennis is a game where we use the swing. Swing, so, um, right? just let the rocket fall down, let it swing easily. Okay, hop, on, hop, and use the power, the energy of the falling rocket, okay, to coordinate it with your motion of the knees, yeah? Okay, good. As I am a friend of playing tennis with both hands, I can teach you this one, okay? Like a dancing movement to pass the rocket from one hand to the other, okay, and let it hit your back, okay, this is the swing, okay, you can swing behind your body, down, 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 you can swing below your knees, up, 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 and you can turn big circles, like this, you can use the rocket if you want to train like for the surf, okay? Uh, and hop, uh, hop, and swing it easily, hop, and hop, okay. So, and actually, you can balance the rocket, okay? And what is the trick by balancing? You just cannot simply put it there and say stab, and then it's allowed to fall, no? You have to move your hand slightly so that you, you provoke you provoke this rocket so it starts to fall and then immediately you can catch it and then you can make it difficult for you to go down in your knees in both knees then you change the hand here okay and you go up again and again and again up okay so these are the coordination exercises without the ball. And what do we do with the ball? Well, well like this. Get your hand ready here up to coordinate the tempo. Okay, you throw it up and you catch it here. Up. You do not move this head. You do not move, move this hand down. You simply throw it up, catch it, throw it up, catch it, throw it up. Okay. Coordination, eye and the hand. Not so easy. Up. Okay. Four. Four. Okay. One. One. Two. Two. And three. And three. And four. And four. And five. Okay. That's only four. So this easy, you can throw it very high, you can make seven. But this one is difficult. Clap above and below the ball and then catch it. Hop. <laughs> Hop. 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 Okay. And throw it over your shoulder. Throw it over your shoulder. Hop. And hop. And then this one. Okay. Hop. Okay, so, and with the ball and the rocket, naturally, what we have first is simply pumping in your knees and moving your hand and so that the ball does not jump, okay, does not jump, okay, then, throw it and catch it in this way, so that it does not bump up, bump off the rocket, yeah? 
you have to go down with the onions. You have to follow the ball as it is falling, and then as you touch it, you take it to the side, and you go with the onions down at the same time. Hop, okay. Hop, and then the other side. Hop. Oh, up. Okay, and the left hand. Oh, oh, wrong. This one. Okay, it's not so easy as with the right hand, but nevertheless you try. Because coordination is some, has something to do with brain. <laughs> Left and s right side of the brain. And the other side. Good. Okay, so these are the exercises you can do alone. I'll show you some other exercises on the wall, on the training wall. But for the time, I mean, when I have a partner, I'll show you the exercises with the partner. So for the time being, it's all. Remember that we are trying to connect. This is uh, for Czech students. We are trying to connect uh, the English. You know? learning English with sport, okay? And those who are interested in sport, naturally, they can do it in any language they want. I speak Czech, English, and German very well. Okay. Bye-bye.